All right, let's get this shit started. Let me drag that down a bit. Getting a There we go. That's um that's reasonable. I think we can live with that. I think that works out reasonably well. Okay. All right. I just upgraded to OBS 29. So, um, where is my capture card at 10 dB? That's not right. Um, let's, uh, let's drop the trim down and we'll drop the trim down a bit and we'll. Amplify somewhat in software. That should do it. Okay. Okay. Alrighty then. So, what was I doing there? Um, device, properties, filters. There's okay. Okay, I got output gain on it. Alright. Alright. Okay then. <coughs> Man, I'm kind of, I'm a little bit out of it right this very moment. But, um, but we are going to work on these mountains again. And there's some stuff that I need to, uh, some stuff that I need to address in this. I don't think I've done a very good job on these mountains so far. We're going to be improving them a bit. A bit, a bit, a bit, just a bit. But first, let's clean off this screen. Now, I did manage over the course of the past week. Oh, I should go over that. Over the course of the past week, I have spent some time. I have spent some time doing additional work. I have been saying I want to start doing that. I want to start doing something every day. I did not do something every day. I did nothing on. Uh, I did nothing on Sunday, or Monday. Or, or Tuesday, because <laughs> I'm a terrible person. But I did get around to doing some stuff on uh, on Wednesday and Thursday, and um, and of course I'm doing some stuff today. But uh, let me go and jump into the. Ooh, gotta set this up. Uh, let me go and fire up the screen share over on the Discord before I get started talking about that. And okay, we're gonna jump into the voice channel and we're gonna go share the screen and we're gonna scroll on down. Um, remember to do the little YouTube dance, of course. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the little bell icon, all of that. And my lighting is just terrible. Really need to do something with this lighting. Just, it's just not very good. I'm not uh, not pleased with it. Okay, so anyway, um, over the course of the week, I did on three separate occasions sit down and do some stuff, and um, and the stuff that I did. Let me kind of jump over here. I did some. Uh, I did some kind of arbitrary. Well, that's like nothing. Uh, I did some arbitrary stuff, and uh, I took this piece that I did in uh, in an AI generator, and I was kind of working on improving that. Didn't do a whole lot with that, but the thing that I started on here was um, I, I started working on some like specific practice. I took a bunch of pictures of Kobeni from Chainsaw Man, and I went through and I collected about 30 different poses. And what I'm working on here is I kind of Come over here and I do the uh, I do the the gesture drawing and then over here I do the uh, and over here I do the composition. Let me just kind of okay. So like over here I do the so like over here. What is going on here? 
Oh, it's because I'm on the transparent. Okay, so. So over here, I sort of do a quick gesture drawing, and over here, I do some construction, and over here, I try to duplicate the, uh, I try to duplicate the, the final sketch. And I've done that with two of them, and I've, I've noticed some stuff I'm using kind of red for the gesture and blue for the composition and green to make notes on the final sketch. And uh, I've gone through and I've done that for two of them. I haven't started on the third one yet. And, uh, and those are kind of, those are the things that I've been working on. But I've also done, over the course of this, I have... Pull this up here. Uh, I have got some... Uh, I have got some sketches that I've done just like over the course of stuff. And this is just sort of an upper body study. And then I've got, uh, I've got some random garbage that I did with gesture drawing again and working with, uh, working with some stuff around the axillary structure under the arm, which is what led into this. And, uh, no, don't say that. But uh, but right now we're going back to the uh, we're going back to the shitscape, and uh, and I kind of feel like I need to dump out of the crap version that I've done here, and start working on a slightly different version. Now, um, one of the things that has um, that has kind of jumped out at me over the course of the last week. Is um, on mountains, you sort of get this. You sort of get this thing going on where uh, if you sort of look at this here, if you look at the reference. You can see that there's a line that comes down. There's the top of the mountain, and then there's these lines that come down that kind of map to the top parts and the bottom parts of the mountain. So it, it kind of divides things up into planes. And you can see here you've got the uh, you've got the contour of the mountain. Let me drop that down. You got the contour of the mountain there. Okay. And then you've got this peak of where the mountain's high parts are. And you've got these valleys of where the low parts are. So you kind of get these little striations, these little sort of valleys and peaks that happen inside of the structure of the mountain. So what I'm thinking along the lines of is, I got to do something like that here. I got to think of this. Let me uh, pop in a new layer here. I gotta think of this in terms of, you know, sort of a much lighter purple here. We want to have sort of a peak and valley thing going on here in the mountains, okay? And this peak and valley thing needs to sort of identify those areas of the mountain that are uh, that are up the highest and down the lowest and whatnot. And then from these, I should at that point be able to go, okay, the light is coming from this direction over here, so this part of the mountain is going to be lit, and this part is going to be shaded, but then this part is going to be lit. So then I could sort of identify which parts of the mountain are going to be in shadow and which are going to be in light. And once I've got that, okay, once I've got that idea, then I can kind of do something around this idea. And I think, uh, I think really what I want to do is sort of think in terms of following these contours. So in here, for example, we'd have, we'd have kind of a light area. Here, we'd have kind of a light area. And 
and that would kind of be our uh, that would kind of be our light and shadow setup. But in order to do that, we need to. Um, I was looking at some uh, I was looking at some tutorials, obviously, over the course of the last week, and one of the things I was looking at was somebody said that uh, your brush tip needs to be um, needs to be a particular thickness. So it's like if you make the brush tip thinner, like so. I don't need, I don't think it need to be that thin, but like like that, and then you add an angle to it. Like okay, let's go. Yeah, about like that. So working from that, we can now we can take a sort of a highlighty color. Highlight about like that just sort of rough in sort of the shape mountains and wow that's that really is making a uh, kind of a difference there. I don't know whether we really need that. Maybe we need to um I think for the sake of uh I think for the sake of getting this to look halfway decent. Carve away that. and carve away that. Redo the uh, well, then redo that uh, sort of highlighting. And then from that, what I want to do at this point, I think, is I want to do a sort of darker and maybe, maybe if I low light there and if I come in here and I go, all right, what if my angle were... angle or pointed the other direction like that. Now if I come in here and just kind of put some hello Just put that in there. Okay. Here's the low light area. Sort of do a low light there, but then from this I want to Take the hardness down a bit. Kind of smooth that out a bit.
then we can uh, pull our angle back to 37. More strength something of a feel. Let's um back down over here. Some um, kick our angle back over to one thirty. Okay. Top here. little Less saturated over here. Once again, we'll pull our angle down to about there's the tips, and then we'll. Uh, Down lower. That off. Well, uh, this actually looks much better. Um, I'm getting a, uh, getting a much better feel off of this. Let's um, put our angle on. See, so we're that right. And will you there? Just by kind of uh, sizing the is there now I think more There. Some sort of change back to thirty here and
And I think what? Highlights. What? So let's do that. I think I, think I want to move away from using the blending brush so And uh, I think at this point, I think what we need is kind of a uh, very okay. So we'll take that up there. Take that. To our standard 100 and angle no longer matters. We'll take that back down to zero. I want to put this back. Yeah. So uh, now with that, I want to take and kind of light, and I want to go and just kind of saturate. Just kind of give this some distance fog. I don't know that I like the way it's coming. I'm not liking that either. Okay, so that's not bad. I'm not unhappy with it. Um, okay. All right. I'm not, uh, I'm not unhappy with this. I think, uh, I think I've got something approximating. It looks like mountains, doesn't it? I think um I think we want to fuzz out the uh huh. How am I gonna think here I just want to cut just want to sort of
think good and big. Keep accident scroll. Start to see now to make this recede. I think what I need is to, um, See if I can't. I'm not liking that either. What if I make it a bit bigger? Okay. So fifteen. I don't know that that's working at all. I don't know. I don't know what the right way to make the um, make this receipt. That's done something. Um, I feel like I've accomplished something with that, and that um, that works reasonably well. See what the results look like. And I'm not liking those at all. Kind of like the uh, sharper results that we Yeah. I'm liking this look a lot better. I'm not really sure how I feel about what this needs. Is, um, it needs a little ambient light. Just right up at the
Let's try that. Kind of keep it sort of rim like situation. Uh, Or, you know, I could just, um, could just clip to where below. Um, where did that work? Oh, there we go. That works. That works very well, except for this part up here. And our opacity back down eighteen. Um, uh, a little more. and let's see The uh, here. Hmm. Hold that back a bit. Or brush.
page. Get a little more hardness. Much. Brighter version. Okay. Soft. We'll pick it up a bit more. When we come down here, oh. And I'm not entirely unhappy with this. Definitely looking better, but I feel like I feel like this. Like 
this. Again, will be thirty three, about ten. And let's uh, I'll bet this stuff. Oh, player. Um. That's locking the player. It's not. This here. I need to get better depending on the right player. Carefully, painstakingly, you know what? Selection for player, create selection. Um, click, delete. Oh. 
the fuck is that? Well, doesn't matter. Why? because of selection properties for some reason. I don't know. Anyway, let's turn the uh, highlighting back on. Let's see what we got. That um, still looks pretty good. First of Problem. Now we'll Like in the funding there. Back to my brush. Uh, should give us more. All right. That gives us that gives us something. It doesn't look that bad. Okay, I I think I think things are improved. Not sure how much they've improved, but 
something has been done. We're we're starting to we're starting to look like some kind of uh, we're starting to look like a landscape at least. I mean, it's not not terrible. Um. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and save that off. And uh, crap, we're uh, we're closing up on that hour mark, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, and stop the uh, stop the stream, stop the recording anyway, and start uh, getting this uploaded. So um, thanks for dropping by. Thanks for hanging out with me while I did all this stuff and was very boring and uninteresting, <coughs> except for that sneeze just there. That was interesting. Am I the only person who thinks sneezes are interesting? I think sneezes are interesting. Uh, but anyway, uh, you know, once again, do the little YouTube dance, like, comment, subscribe, hit the little bell icon, all of that bullshit. Okay, bye.